sodium oxide users and um, new sodium oxide users. Um, this is Milan, founder of sodium oxide, and today I'm going to be showing you um, um, the new website and um, for a set a quick setup guide to install Siri on your iDevice. Okay, first thing I'm going to show you is that the website, the new website. From this, I'm closing down this website. Yeah, soon. And I'm gonna. I mean, and I've made. A, I've created a new website. That's what I've been doing since the last video. Yeah. And yeah, I'm gonna show you in three, two, one. His new website, Siri Oxide some point, version seven point five, making Siri alive in every eye device. Um, Siri Oxide making Siri alive in every eyes. It's got some pictures here. Yeah. And this home and um, basically you can comment on here. You click on here. And then you just leave a reply. Let's go to the next bit. I'm going this through quickly because I'm going to show you a setup guide. I need time for that to show you a setup guide. This is about, yeah, um, it's the port is still free and it's for the iPhone 4, Apple Touch, and iPad. Yeah, and yeah, that's the author. And about, I mean, author is um, the creator of Siri Oxide that's creating. Has created the following websites, which is all this created so far. You can click on them by going to the link and sub subscribe, like, and follow. Yeah, the least you can do is to, to keep our server running. You don't need to do the only way, it's free. All you have to do is just click on these icons and then log in or sign up of these icons and then add me as a friend and subscribe and like or follow. Yeah, there's another way to subscribe as well is um, follow me on FodPod. Yeah, it's like a video thing. Just follow me. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna be showing you this video today soon, and um, afterwards. And there's another way as well. You just click on it's like an icon at the corner saying "Follow Siri Oxide 7.5." Yeah, um, get every new get every new post delivered in your inbox, which includes new videos. Okay. The next thing is um, download. Quite simple. Yeah. What you have to do is point your browser at serioxide.weebly.com and on your iDevice, on any of your iDevices, yeah, and then download on mobile. It's quite simple as the last video. For new users, um, you just go to his website, exactly what I said. Okay, and if you want the proxy URL, you just email me at serioxide at homework.co.uk. Okay, and saying that you want the proxy URL, and I'll just give it to you soon. And it's still free. In legal terms, you have to read this. It's showing you what you're downloading and what you're doing and what you're basically using Siri for. And it's quite important because just in case you any faults on Siri and stuff like that, it's all in the legal terms and use conditions. Okay, today I'm going to be showing now the next part of the video is um, um, actually, down, actually installing Siri on your iDevice. So I'm going to be showing you that today. First, I'm going to be showing you that it's on because I'm running on iPhone 4. As you can see over here, it's GSM as ISO 5.0.1 in CDL 1.1.3. That's the main value that you need to know that I'm running on iPhone 4 and not on iPhone 4S. Okay. Um, the first thing I'm going to do is going to check if Siri is working. Yeah, it might be a little bit glitchy on the VNC on this VNC thing. If you are yeah, uh, because it's quite slow, my internet connection, sorry about that. Um, so I'm going to press hold the hold button. Hi Siri. It takes quite time. It's getting loaded now. Some of you may have heard of that. Heard that zero zero size as you can see it's clearly working. Yeah. And um, what's the weather like? Checking my sources. Here is the forecast for two hundred forty. Two hundred forty. Yeah, and that's my house number and here's the weather work. There is a lot more that you can do with Siri, which I'll be showing you in the intro. Yeah, and there's a lot more than that in the intro as well, which I've been adding. Yeah, and yeah. So basically, new update includes um, um, the new updates include like um, 
updated the certificate, new voice commands and etc bug fixes and crash fixes like you've had before on Seox side users okay um next thing is to show you how to install Siri on your device so what we're going to do you need to install our file from Cydia install our file from Cydia and then um and then like install our file it's quite some um depends what source you add it's normally free our file but some users make it paid because they want to get paid. Okay, I'm, I'm going to open the iFile. So, say if, so we're just showing you that, assume that you're, that you're using um, um, iFile and you have downloaded it already. Okay, I'm just going to quickly go on back. So what we're going to do is, right at the top, yeah, you can, you can see this slash button here, which is over here. Yeah, and um, when you're on that page, um, you have to just go to go to the bottom and just type, and then press var. Click on var. Click on var. This one here. Yeah. Don't delete it. Whatever it says there. Just open it up. Okay. Now you're in var. Scroll down to um, mobile, which is over here. Yeah, make sure you listen carefully. Then you open um, library, open library, and then open. Um, you see preferences. All done. I see preferences over here, which is coming up when this video comes. Up. You can see preferences here. And then you click on preferences. Okay, and now um, whenever that comes up on the screen, yeah, here it comes. Like you're gonna see servers like you can see scripts like this, yeah. And if you have installed um, another um, certificates before, for like iPhone Siri installed that, you need to delete them. Okay, what, how, what we're gonna do is we're gonna show you how to delete it. Go to edit, which is over here. Select, you need to select the, these important ones. Dot com, um, dot apple, dot accessibility, dot please. Select it. Go and scroll down. And then you'll find dot com, dot apple, the assistance, dot out assistance, dot please. Yeah, then you see that. And then you're gonna scroll down you see at the bottom of the thing and then you see bin you're gonna move it to trust i don't want to do that because my server is working fine okay and that's the most important part of the thing and once you've done that make sure you turn it off your device yeah we'll see it to work um i mean for like the certificate to install okay and the next thing is yeah um you're gonna install spire which is you must have a jailbroken iPhone for this, yeah, and obviously for iPhone. So you scroll down to Spire over here. I can't open it because it includes the proxy in it, which I can't show you. You install Spire and then you get this device screen, and I'll be showing you that afterwards as well. Okay, the next thing is that um, you need to open your browser and um, put your address at. Um, Siri Oxide, Siri Oxide dot Weebly dot com. Just put in your browser at that, and it says like welcome and stuff like that. Yeah, and then it shows a menu over here. Now, when you're on the menu, you click on that in the menu, and then it shows download on mobile. You click download on mobile, which is over here. It's for new users and old users as well. Yeah, and stored in your because I've updated this so, so new so old users, I mean so the current users right now you need to install the series server again and then get the proxy URL. There's a new proxy URL I'm giving out and yeah. So then I'm gonna cancel it because I've already installed it. It just says install because it's um it's an updated version which I've already installed. It goes off to, it goes off after twenty four hours. Yeah. 
um well obviously my, my okay and the next part is um this is the next part of the video as you can see it stopped for a little while and then that carried on okay is um that um to get the save proxy you just have to email me and you just have to email me on cvoxide at homo.co.uk yeah and then like i'll add you to my contacts and i'll and i'll send you the serial proxy it's quite simple and then all you have to do is once i send you the serial proxy within 24 hours yeah um you just basically what me tan what you do is go to siri and make sure it's on enabled on yeah for me to connect mm. to it and make sure it's english us yeah so um it works perfectly more in english us than uk so yeah it, look, it looks more nicer and it responds more easier yeah and it can understand more okay i don't I really understand that and if you want to move it in case like um you have problems and i send you emails here's the profile you might not able to see it it's over here yeah profile save server you can move it from here at any time you want yeah so before basically before um downloading the new save server yeah make sure you move the old one and then do the iFile thing what I showed you. Okay. Um the next bit is that um once you've done the serial proxy, uh once you've put the serial proxy in file settings and scroll down to spire which is over here. Once you've done that let me scroll down. Spire, yeah, um put your proxy URL and then press return and then wait six hours again and then I'll activate Siri for you and it's quite simple and if you want assist, and if you want like Siri extensions yeah you just like um, get ex extension assistant extensions from Cydia it's right for any i device so that's right so don't don't download any other i device don't download any other assistant extension because this is the right one that you need it's consistent extra extensions and the icons kind of like ae and then siri which is over here sorry about this a little bit glitchy yep and yep so okay then yeah iap cracker and stuff like that okay this thing that i'm going to show you is um like a rundown on siri of the new things that you can do with siri hi siri hi siri Sometimes it does make a little bit of mistakes. Yeah, as you can see, as you can hear that it says, it's, um, so it's your side and stuff like that. I don't want to be a long time on that because I wanted to show you the new vid, um, the new intro to Siri. And I was showing you because the full Siri apparently deleted, um, used my thing and then edited it and then added, added iPhone Siri to it. So I'm going to be showing you another thing and I hope iPhone Siri does not copy this video. Okay, so I'm going to open this. I'm just going to put my volume louder. You see, you just have, all you have to do is um, pause it and then open it on the thing, on full screen. Yeah, sorry, it's a little bit slow. Well, I need to fix that anyway, whatever it says there. Yeah, I can't open it. Okay, so I'm gonna press it. Okay.
as you can see, it's quite similar to Apple. Yeah, and um, that's it. Yeah, of the video. You can play, share, and then play if you want to. It's alright if you can like um, share this video, but you need to copy it. Um, next thing is um, yeah, um, that's it for the video today. Subscribe, like, and comment on my videos. And yeah, I keep still running fast, perfect, new extensions and stuff like that. My new video will be coming soon on the new website. Actually, quite a long time because I just recently made this video. And yeah, I hope you subscribe. Yeah, for new users. Okay, thanks for letting me commentate to you.